Hi, I'm Dr. Anna Bonetti, part of the pulmonology team at Baptist Memorial Hospital Golden Triangle. Tonight, I want to talk to you about what to expect when you're diagnosed with COPD. If you have COPD, you can continue to be treated by your primary care provider, or you may be referred to a pulmonologist, who is a doctor who diagnoses and treats diseases of the airways and lungs. A pulmonologist may do a specialized test to learn about your lung capacity and prescribe the best treatment for your condition. You may also be referred to a smoking cessation program or a pulmonary rehabilitation program where you will learn more about COPD, how to manage your symptoms, and exercise under the supervision of a healthcare practitioner. A team of caregivers in a pulmonary rehabilitation program may include physical therapists, exercise specialists, nurses, and dietitians. Many people think exercise is impossible if you have COPD. Shortness of breath can make exercise more difficult, but exercising is a very important part of treating COPD. Exercise doesn't change the lungs. Instead, it improves the way the heart pumps blood and muscles take oxygen out of the blood, making the whole system more efficient. You should start slowly, but your exercise capacity goes up when you do continual exercise. Also, remember it's never too late to quit smoking and potentially ward off COPD. Even if you've already been diagnosed with COPD, don't give up this quitting smoking battle. At any stage of COPD, quitting smoking will lessen your symptoms and slow the progression of this disease. Join us next time for Health Talk with Baptist. Mail your topic suggestions to healthtalk at wcbi.com. Health Talk has been brought to you by Baptist Memorial Hospital Golden Triangle.